Hey everybody, I'm Steph from Destination Exploration at the University of Lethbridge, and I'm so excited that you're gonna be joining our Arconic STEM Club this year. Today we're gonna to do a quick unboxing so that you're ready for the first day of club. So you've joined our civil and mechanical engineering topic, and that means that you have your very own Sphero Mini, which is super exciting because this thing is awesome to play with. So let's go ahead and unbox everything, which is great. So let's first start off, of course, with everybody's favorite, the Sphero Mini. It comes in this awesome case, but it's sometimes a little difficult to open, so just pinch the sides here and pull it open. You'll notice that the Sphero's actually attached. There's some little bit of glue on there so you can hold it up and it should stay where it is and not roll around. So what you can do is you can pull it off and hold it in your hand, it should roll around, but then you're looking at it and you're going, how do I even charge this thing? Because right now it's not working. So you're gonna need to go to your pins, cables, and USB cord, open that up, grab the blue USB cord. That's what we're gonna use to charge it with. Inside this box, there's also the cover, the instruction booklet, and of course, these super cute, little bowling pins and construction cones. So in order to be ready for the first day of club, we actually have to charge it up beforehand. So to do that, you'll notice that you can't actually find any object to kind of, that fits the cord. So what you're gonna have to do is actually pop it open. So take the two sides, and it's gonna open up along that blue seam, twist it and kind of pop it open like a Kinder Egg surprise. And then the part inside of it right here, that is the actual sphero. You can see the wheels and you can now see the opening for the USB cord. Simply plug it into your sphero and then plug it into your computer. You'll see that it's gonna flash um, blue. That means that it's charging. Once it's a solid green, it means that it's fully charged and you are ready to go. Let's do that now and then we'll go through what else is in the box. So we've already gone through our cables, pins and cones. We've got these little plastic bag, great to keep around so we don't lose any of these things. But what's really important in here is the cover. And the cover goes around the outside, it opens up like this, it goes inside. And this is great to add friction to your Sphero. So if you're traveling on hardwood or anything that's got a slippery surface, this is gonna give it a little bit of grip. So it's like putting shoes on your Sphero rather than just socks. So you can grab your activity cards, you can open it up, take the plastic off, and there's some fun little activities that you can use and do and explore with to get started if you want. And then of course your 28 piece construction set. We've got lots of fun stuff in here. We've got some rainbow loops, so things to set up so that your Sierra can travel underneath it. We've got some guards and we've got some little pieces. So these are what you can slide your rainbow piece into and so that it stays up and doesn't wobble because it's pretty hard to balance something like this. Now that your Sphero is charged, you're wondering, how do I control this? Well, we need an app. We need a device that's gonna control it through Bluetooth. So you're gonna open up your app on your phone, your tablet, or a MacBook. They all have this downloadable app, looks something like this. And once it's downloaded and your Bluetooth is on, the connection is pretty simple. So we're gonna open it up. We're going to choose, go, jump through any of the tutorials that pop up. You're gonna choose connect to robot. You're gonna make sure that you're looking for Sphero Mini. And as long as your Sphero Mini and your tablet or your phone or your computer are close together, it should pop up and you can just click that name and your Sphero will come to life. And that's it, now you're connected. You can play around with the app or wait until the first day of club. Just make sure that your Sphero is charged and ready to go.